A new era at the home of champions begins now, and it is beautiful. My name is Ricardo Chambers. It's a pleasure to have you, and it's a pleasure to welcome you all to our new space, downtown Kingston, the new look of the Sportsman Zone, the new look of the home of champions. The full team, Mariah Ramarek, Lance Whitaker, both here with me as we celebrate this monumental moment. Lance, Mariah. Yeah, as we said at the top of the show, it's a historic moment. It's a beautiful day and as you can see viewers, the set looks glittering. It's brand new and we're so happy to be sitting here. And of course, as we keep reminding you, the reason we do everything that we do is just for you at home. So now you can tune in on our fancy set and of course enjoy uh, consuming all the different sporting topics. Yeah, you know what? Um, we are cable television, Sportsmax television, and uh, because we are on cable, we are competing with world television. Yes. And our standards have to be impeccable, and uh, that is part and parcel of what we are experiencing here, where we have elevated ourselves from what we had in our previous studio to uh, a look now that everyone here is, is proud of. We are the home of champions, and champions are pace setters. And uh, that is what we are uh, pretty much announcing today with this launch of the new studio. Yeah, very much the case. Um, of course, uh, one of the things that this studio will allow us is for new careers to begin. So Lance is going to have his first opportunity to do the catwalk. Mariah Ramarat wanted to be the one um, to do it. But Lance Whitaker, let's show off your beautiful full suit. <laughs> Are you ready? <laughs> well, for just over 11 years, the studio at uh, Chalmers Avenue on Mullines Road, Jamaica, housed the pioneering Caribbean's number one television sports talk show. I am honored to have been a part of the show from its inception in July 2011, working with all presenters who have hosted this show. Now we make a transition, stepping up a uh, level to this new state-of-the-art studio at our new home in downtown Kingston. And uh, we are now going to have a quick chat with our program manager. Uh, he is, of course, Mr. Ransford Ricketts. Uh, Ransford, um, I am really honored to be here. I'm sure as a programmer, this is a very special moment for you. A special moment indeed, Lance. A special moment, a lifetime that I, moment that I, that, that, that I cherish to be interviewed by world-renowned Lance Whitaker. <laughs> I'm honored to be in your presence, sir. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Well, I know that um, Sportsmax has property content wise that we have all been proud of for almost two decades now and um, you are the person that disseminates the programming to the public. How do you feel about this new studio and what it will afford us as, as television producers to present to our viewers? Well Lance you touch on a very good note there and um, as we look at especially let me start with one of the big ones Paris, the Olympics, is there anything bigger than that? Well, we have the World Cup football but those are the two global content and as the, the the host broadcaster here in the Caribbean for the Olympics this is just in time for such a great event that is coming up here right here and you can see throughout the Caribbean on Sports Max yes we have partners who we'll share with but the primary content will be produced here um, at, at, at 22 Ocean Boulevard yeah Ransford how proud are you of the work that Sportsmax is doing because you came to Sportsmax from local television to a, a domestic market. The platform is completely different now because you are programming and presenting to a, a far wider audience. How, how proud of you of, uh, are you of, of what we have achieved so far? Proud is maybe a limited word, um, a limited adjective right now from the vocabulary to describe that land. Um, it, it's a monumental step up. It is, you're, you're talking a local market to know in 30 countries, different cultures, different backgrounds, different appetite, and yet you have to uh, present in the homes something that can be uh, uh, enjoyed by the entire um, Caribbean population. And also, we have to remember that our sister channel, Scene TV, that broadcasts in North America as well, carries a number for local content. So it is very, very, it's a very, very proud moment, Lance. Yeah, of course, our sister station, you just referenced the North American um, audience that we have as, uh, as well, Scene TV, which the Sportsman Zone is shown on live daily. What is the feedback like coming from our North 
American neighbors about what sports match Tremendous, offers. tremendous. Um, they are challenging us, challenging us as well because the appetite is growing. And because that is growing, they're asking for more stuff. And we are always on the ground listening. Our ears are listening. So there are some things that we have to do. But we know that when we go on the ground, people ask about the content. People talk about the various content that we have on the platform and what else that we are bringing to them in the diaspora plus content from the diaspora that we're actively working on we've been doing some of that and we continue to do that so it, it is something that keeps us on our toes but it's something that we are proud of and we are proud of the pressure and the team and we're thankful for the team that we work with to make this possible so that we can satisfy those appetite that is in the diaspora and in the caribbean market yeah, okay. Well, uh, Ransford, great talking to you. We look forward to several more years of outstanding programming from, from you as a program manager at Sportsmax and um, uh, continued outstanding content. The NBA is one of our biggest um, contents. And uh, we, let, let me we just list some of those as well, because I know you're going land, but the Champions League, the CPL, yeah. Yeah. we have those. The Champions League is coming August 19, August 20. Yeah. Schoolboy football, the Sportsmax zone is daily on, on, the, on the channel and also on scene TV. Yeah. So these are the SSFL. We you know, we have unearthed a number of, uh, of content and we just want to tell it, all our partners yes. thank you and our viewers that makes us go and keep us going every day. Yeah. We want to tell them thanks as well. Okay, Ransford Ricketts there. He is the program manager here at Sportsmax and uh, he's been doing a fantastic job and we now have a platform in this new studio to present an even uh, better uh, daily coverage of the Sportsmax zone for you as well as other programs because stay tuned, we'll have a lot more coming. Yeah, of course, uh, Lance. Uh, l let's see the walk. I mean, we've, we've, we've been calling for the walk and you've been practicing for quite a while. <laughs> ah, do you think he can get a contract, Mariah? I need to teach him a bit or two. Uh, you don't think Lance can get a contract? A contract for what? To walk? Oh my God! I just think the combination of what he offers—he's a decent jockey, he's a great, not this jockey now, but he he's, he's a decent jockey, um, <laughs> a fantastic DJ, um, singer. I mean, of course, Lance Whitaker can get a contract. He didn't specify <laughs> what type of contract. He just said, "Can he get a contract?" So of course, I had to ask some questions. I, I wasn't talking muscle contract, Mariah. <laughs> oh gosh, you're you're an awful person. Um, <laughs> by the way, Ransford Ricketts was just talking about uh, the mm -hmm. um, many events and programs that we have on the home of champions. And one of the things that we do great here at uh, Sportsmax is that we tell stories really well. And nobody, absolutely nobody, does it better than Donald Oliver. and welcome to the home of champions. Allow us to reintroduce ourselves. Some of the best sporting moments, you saw it right here. Ball turns on the big engine and takes cover! We have the granddaddy of sporting events, the Olympic Games. We'll see you in Paris in 2024. And also in London for the UEFA Champions League final. Right. We are the eternal home of the biggest party in sport, the Caribbean Premier League, as well as the Indian Premier League. Plus, the world's best basketballers ply their trade in the NBA, La Liga, the Europa League, the Conference League, and the WTA live here. And joining our ranks now, the CONCACAF Nations League. We are in 1.5 million homes across 26 Caribbean territories. And yeah, the best of us is the best of the region. High school football coverage in Jamaica and Trinidad and Tobago is at a premium. So too, the new look horse racing coverage from Caymanus Park. And we are the home of the Jamaica Premier League. And for the Karufta Games, you did not know her before these games, then you know her now. We have the best track and field commentators and analysts in the world. The, the premier sporting show on Caribbean television is the Sportsmax Zone. Plus, watch award winning documentaries and features from some of the world's best storytellers on Sportsmax, Sportsmax 2. Sportsmax Plus free on the Dynamic Sportsmax app. The 
as well as our sister station Scene TV in North America, Canada, and the United Kingdom. With content being streamed on the Scene app, Scene YouTube channel, and Scene.tv. But more is coming. The dawn of a new day for you is right at hand with the launch of our state of the art studio. Multi camera switching, HD production, real time graphics, and virtual reality integration. All at hand for your next major production. The perfect home for content creators and filmmakers with audio productions and green screen capabilities. In addition to remote tailored productions catered to your next live event. Sportsmax has changed the production landscape since 2002. And we have a pulse on the future. So, are you ready? Let's go. Twenty-one years, and we continue to push the envelope. We continue to get so much better on your home of champions and Lance and Mariah. Some outstanding events coming up, of course. The schoolboy football has already started in Jamaica and the Trinidad and Tobago, and we continue to bring to you the very best of that. The UEFA Champions League is coming up as well, and we'll be broadcasting that. Not just the live matches, um, but of course, we will also be having pre- and post-game analysis and the Sportsman Zone always here um, to give you some wonderful analysis as well um, on just about any sport that it is, any major issue that it is across the region and the world. So um, a lot for our viewers to digest over the next 12 months, Lance and Mariah. Yeah, one of the things that I've always been very, very proud about is the fact that we're never short of content. You mentioned the Champions League, but Ricardo, one of my favorites coming up, the NBA as well. Uh, the Olympics, we're already started planning we're looking forward to Paris you know we also have a lot of local content and that's something Sportsmax we take keen interest in ensuring every day land screams at the staff to ensure that we include stories from all around the Caribbean so that no Caribbean country ever feels that they're not a part of the home of champions we want to uh, ensure that we make every one of you feel a part of our home and of course we're always very accessible if you have a story that you feel that you want us to chase there are so many ways in which you can get in contact with us we want to ensure that we continue to be your number one and we continue to bring you all the best in the world of sports yeah you know what i think one thing that we have to highlight is the fact that as broadcasters and as presenters or our content by itself is just part of what Sportsmax does because as a production house over the past decade Sportsmax has made huge strides and part of the reason for Sportsmax's popularity is that the production arm of the company has grown immensely over the last five or six years so as you see sometimes we don't uh, we don't just stick to sports we produce shows stage shows and massive events and it tells you about the capabilities of Sportsmax that although we are a television station that primarily broadcasts sporting content as a production house Sportsmax now is the go-to place in in the Caribbean and uh, that is something that we have to be really really proud about because we have raised the bar significantly as far as how um, live broadcasts are produced because of the um, high-tech equipment and the cameras and so on that we now have and um, I think we are, we are setting a very very brisk pace and I'm not sure there is anyone who can follow it. No, and what I love, team, is the fact that behind the scenes, and we always need to mention, because of course you see Lance, myself, and Ricardo every day, but we have a brilliant team. We have youngsters, we have people ranging from different age groups that of course join our family from time to time. They pick up the pace and they become 
one of us. They ensure daily that you see the content that you want. They ensure every day that we are live to bring you all the action. 4.30 in Jamaica, 5.30 p.m. ECT. So, you know, a lot of kudos have to go to our staff that work behind the scenes. You may not see them, but of course, you know, they have a major role to play. Yeah, and Lance and Mariah started the conversation. And after the break, our CEO will join us, Nicholas Matthews, because he will tell us so much more about the many offerings from the Home of Champions.